My colleagues and I are so happy to be here in Winnipeg for the Supreme Court's first ever sitting outside of Ottawa. And personally, I'm excited to be here at my very first press conference outside of Ottawa. I hope this won't be the last time for either one. We are here in the courtroom where later this week, the Supreme Court of Canada will hear two cases. A big part of the reason I wanted the court to sit in other countries, in other cities, I'm sorry, is to make that a little easier for people who cannot easily travel to Ottawa to see Canada's highest court in person. But I, I think that uh, we have great institutions in Canada. Um, I think we should be very proud of our institution. Um, and, uh, and one of those institutions, uh, of course, is the court. And uh, I, what the people should know is that we have a very strong judicial independence in Canada. And judicial independence is not for judges. It's for the citizens. And they have to understand that, and we have to explain that as well. Because when, when we have to release a decision, people should expect that the decision will be made uh, on an impartial basis, and that we could not suffer any pressure from, from, of any kind by anybody else. So it is uh, very important that we keep our judicial independence for the benefit of the citizen, and that will support, of course, a strong democracy.